Howdy folks, friends and neighbors. This is Tony Thomas, glad to be with you. This is volume 11 of Old Time Banjo, as easy as one, two, three. We're gonna work on a old folk song today called John Henry. And you all have watched my videos uh, before know the drill. Get that banjo in standard G tuning and just pay attention and watch and listen. Develop the year for what I'm doing and, and you can play loud right along with it and you will uh, escalate into being a banjo player to some degree. The more you practice, the better you're going to get. And that's what I'm here for is to help my friends and neighbors out to start out with an easy, easy method. I believe in starting out learning easy and, and, and just working my way up. This is a wonderful old song and uh, I'm going to show you the chord uh, procedures. And one chord that we're going to use in it is an E minor, which is really easy to make. I'm going to show you how to make the E minor. You go to your second fret, and you note your first string. Then you go up to your uh, second fret and note your fourth string. There you've got a perfect E minor. And some people would like to do it with their thumb. Still the same chord, E minor. But this is the proper way to do it. But this is a quick way to do it. <laughs> We're gonna go over the old song now. Start off slow and easy. Well, John Henry was a little bitty boy. Sitting on his family's knee, that's a D. He said that trussle let the sea and old railroad. Death of me. That was your D. Started off slow and easy. Gonna sing the chords out to you. Well, G, 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 D. G, 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 G. E minor, E minor, E minor. G, D, G. There's your chords there, right? Let's go over it real slow and easy and get it down right. Well, John Henry was a little baby boy, sitting on his mammy's knee. He said that trussle up to see an old line, why to be the death of me, long, long, why to be the death of me. song there's about a hundred <laughs> hundred verses to that and that's the verses that I learned many years ago and like I say we'll go over this one more time the chord we're gonna sing them out to you well G G G G G G G D Simple to do. 
two, John Henry. Some of our friends had uh, had uh, emailed me over the YouTube, and we're always glad to hear from people, and we try to answer everybody. Wanted to know if dueling banjos, excuse me, I can't talk today. <laughs> dueling banjos, could it be done in the old time fashion? Yes, it can. I'll go over a little bit of the dueling banjos here for our good friends that inquired about it, and. Uh, uh, there's all kinds of ways you can play this particular song, Dueling Banjos. I mean, you can just add to anything you want to and, and, and kind of change things around. Because it's that type of tune, you know, you can put about anything you want to in the Dueling Banjos and it pretty much will come out pretty peachy if you, <laughs> if you work with it. Here's the way I would do it on the old time. Now this is, uh, this is noting here, a lot of noting involved. Just kind of watch my hand. method there and that was kind of a rough version of it but like I say you can improvise and do anything you want to with this old song dueling banjos and it will turn out right if you work at it enough let's go over it one more time <laughs> YouTube, and I'll be glad to put it on for you. God bless you, and just hang in there with it. I know, I know you're doing a good job, and I'm always willing and and I'm always able to try to help my friends. We appreciate y'all so much. God bless. <laughs> 